challenging. <sighs> just I got back from the gym this morning and I decided to go to Lidl, get some bleach and I'm gonna tie dye my old black shirt. Um, I know you, you can do tie dye with colours and white shirts and multicolour shirts but I really love the effect of bleach on a black shirt. So I have done a temp this morning, it turned out okay actually. No, this is the real thing. So yeah, I've watched some videos on it and I'm just going by what I think. Probably not the best thing to do, but that's what I'm doing. So I thought it'd be really good to vlog it and see how this top turns out. I've got the black top here. All I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna lay it out like so. I'm just get a knife in a certain one apart that I want to spiral. And spiral it like so until it's all kinda. I'm gonna do that again. Alright. So from the middle this time. And just spiral it until it's all spiraled into a circle. <laughs> So now I've got to squeeze it together a little bit. Get a bubble. Fold the bubble over it, over that part. And then get another bubble <coughs> and wrap it round the other section. It's literally only spoiled in the middle, but oh well, it's a personal shirt. <laughs> so there is a bit of bleach in the bath still from earlier, as you can see. So this is the pattern, spiral-ish maybe, I don't know. <laughs> so I'm going to do this quick because there is bleach in the bath and it's going to be all different colours if I don't. So what I did earlier, literally just put it all over light coating all over Oops. make sure you get every part and so and then there you go and then I get the scissors to turn it over oh, and do the other side because what I forgot to do earlier was the other side <laughs> so like half of it was black and the other half was all coloured in so yeah I'm happy with that so I've done this side done the other side's changing already as you can see rub that in the bleach remaining in the bath are there any like tie dye experts i'm like no <laughs> good the hell i'm doing it but it is how it is so my other one i left it for seven minutes because i really like the red color in it so if this one takes the same way i'm gonna leave it for like seven minutes and then um wash it out oh my god that's changing so fast wash it out and put it in wash it out like with hot water and then go put it in the washer to make sure it's completely out so uh, yesterday i decided to do this and when i say i watched i watched a couple of videos on it i watched one <laughs> look toe dye shirts um tutorials on youtube are so popular but the ones that aren't that popular are the black ones with bleach i only saw a couple compared to the paint ones but i just don't like colorful tops with the like white and then all the pinks and greens and purples and whatnot so i really wanted to do a black one because i think it looks really nice but everyone i've seen the bleach go they leave it for the bleach to go like orange or like yellow and i'm not into that but the one i did earlier it went like an extreme intense red and it was so pretty so fingers crossed this one works out the same and yeah we just wait 10 minutes now and see what it looks like and decide if to wash it off or not the only thing the man did say in the video i watched yesterday was that um 
if you leave it longer than about 15 minutes like 100% bleach if you leave it for more than 15 minutes it can burn through the top so I don't want that happening obviously so I've got to keep a close eye on you so it's been about three minutes <laughs> this is the shirt over a day oh, let me see if I can turn it over that's the other side as well so definitely want it to take a bit more on these areas the sides it's splattered which is cute the other side yeah hopefully this looks nice everyone that makes like toy dies a lot i'm gonna be watching this video and screaming because <laughs> look at it <laughs> but yeah Fingers crossed it kind of looks okay. It's definitely going an orange colour. The one I did earlier was more red. Um, probably because it was different material. But this is giving me very Halloween-y <laughs> pumpkin um, vibes. It should suit me, especially because of my ginger. But I really love that scattery effect. Let's hold it up to the light so you can see it better. Wow, it's going like white in some parts. It's been about five minutes, I'd say. But yeah, I think I'm gonna wash it off soonish because I don't want it to burn through the shirt. And that looks bright enough, I think, for me. So, time to wash it off. I'm gonna cut the elastic band. Put it this side. And, oh. <laughs> Okay. Oh my god, that is cute actually. There's not a lot of. Wow, that is adorable. I was scared when it was wrapped up that it was going to be like super orange and there was only going to be a bit of black because how much I put on. But no, actually, that is so cute. Right, I'm going to wash it off because I like this colour. So I'll be back after i washed it off to show you what it looks like sorry diane for about five minutes mm. seven minutes max um really did not need long it started to go like what i was talking about like orange and then light light orangey bl and not blonder a yellowish color um, but it looked really nice i sorted it out as much as i could in the bath but i was scared Obviously I wasn't getting all the bleach out, so if I kept on rinsing it, rinsing it, it would have kept getting lighter and lighter because there was bleach still in it, obviously. So Mum's just put it in the wash now, and then I'm going to dry it, and then I'll show you the finished product. But what I've seen so far, it looks really nice. Right, so I've just put a bit of makeup on, put my sleeping hairpiece, and I've got to show you my shirt. So this is the finished product. As you can see on the shoulders, there's a bit of like, I don't know if that's supposed to be like that or if it should be black, but that's how it is. That's the shirt. I think it looks really nice. I'm so happy for like the first time I've ever did it and this is how it turned out. I thought you show you like this as well so you get a better view of it. So, this is the shirt. And you can't see the back but it's the same on the back and on the arms yeah I think it looks really nice for my first attempt and um, I've got lots of different colored t-shirts that are just like plain and I'd like to jazz them up a bit so definitely recommendation uh, I know these was really cool ages ago and now no one likes them but I think they're gonna come back in fashion and I'll have the first one but yeah, I think it looks really, really cool. <laughs> so that's the end of the vlog for this week. I know it's just a quick um, how to do a toy toy dye, bleach dye shirt. Yeah. Next week I am doing something really amazing with my mum, Aunt Pat and my Aunt Kerry. So mm -hmm. stay tuned for next week because it would be a really, really good one. But yeah. Thanks for watching and I hope you liked my attempt of a bleach dye as much as I do. And um, please remember to like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you next week in my really interesting fun video.